Hello friends, it's Kate from LoneStarSouthern.com. Today I am pretty excited. Is that a saying? Or did I just make that up? Because I am going to show you my Barrington Gifts of Distinction collection. For those of you who are like, I'm sorry Kate, what is Barrington Gifts of Distinction? It is my favorite bag line. Truly, I cannot explain how obsessed I am with this brand. I found out about them when I just started my blog about three years ago. I have personally used and loved the products for literally three years and totally vouch and stand behind what they do. I've had so many friends or people that I've recommended it to who've come back and said, I love Barrington now. Like, it's just kind of infectious. I think seeing this video, you're going to see why. One of the things Barrington is known for is its customizability. for prints, different monogram options. The options are endless and it's so much fun to play with. I know from personal experience, whenever I get on their website, I seriously spend hours like creating all these different combinations. It's just so fun. But I always love having inspiration from others. So I can say like, oh, I really liked that color combination or I really liked that monogram style. So I thought I would do a collection video just to give you some inspiration and to introduce you to the brand if you haven't heard of them. I do want to say before I get started that I did not buy every single one of these bags. I think if I watched a YouTube video and a girl was like, here are my 20 Barrington bags, I would be like, can you leave please? I have gotten to work with Barrington on my blog LoneStarSouthern.com a lot. So a lot of these bags have been gifts from them, not me going and buying like a $150 bag every other day. So now that that has been covered, I want to start with the very first Barrington bag I ever got. And the reason I want to show it to you first is because I want you to see how beautifully these bags age. This is the first St. Ann tote I got. Friends, this is three years old. I'm talking three years of heavy use. I use this as a school bag. My junior year of college, I would throw my laptop and all my books into this. I would also use it, slash I still do use it to this day as a purse. And look at how beautifully it's worn in. It's got a leather bottom and these leather straps and it's so roomy inside. <laughs> you kind of get a little peek at the junk situation that's going on in here. I've taken this thing through airports. I've taken it on road trips. This is kind of how the bags age. I wanted you to see that. I love this pattern. I don't think they print it anymore, but as you can see, I chose the option that has the leather stamp with my leather stamp initials. So this is my very first bag, and now that we have that covered, let's go on to my other favorite. I may be a little biased, but I think my favorite bag would have to be the cake collection. So like I said, I have loved Barrington for a long time and through just working on different products with them, I built a relationship and one day they said, hey Kate, we saw your love of pink and orange and we kind of came up with this print and we wondered if you'd be behind it and I fell out of my chair and I died because yes, that is a no-brainer. Truly, like, can we think of a more me bag? One of the things I love so much is, let me see if I can find it. You can't really tell all the way on this bag, but the cross motif on the bottom, it's like kind of woven in there, which as many of you know, faith is like a huge part of my life, the biggest part of my life, and I just love that kind of shout out to Jesus on my bag. Hey Jesus. It was released last summer and I just thought that was really fun. Going off of that, I also have a Kate Collection laptop case. This is an excellent Christmas gift, plus you can make this very boyish and manly. They have lots of boy, prints, boy monograms. Boys, do y'all like those things? I don't know. Anyways, great gift idea, love this thing. The final thing I own from the Kate collection is this darling pencil bag. I use this for all sorts of things. I have two pairs of gold hoop earrings in here, which I'm glad I found, I've been looking for those. I have a bunch of Q-tips. <laughs> this is the best all-purpose bag. I remember in high school, I always wanted, like it was the cool thing to have a cool pencil bag. And I wish this had been around because I would have been I don't know, a cool pencil bag girl, which don't you wanna be a cool pencil bag girl? Now I use this for traveling, I'll either use it for lip glosses and lipsticks, or I'll throw in Q-tips or jewelry. It's like the best little bag, another great gift idea, another thing that you can totally customize too. So back to the St. Anne tote, my favorite of all the Barrington styles. They, within the past, I wanna say year or two, have started having a monogram option. And this is the first monogram bag I got from them. It's this beautiful blue gingham, and it's got a navy and like peachy pink monogram right here. This is just the circle stripe monogram. This bag in particular looks so cute with like a crisp white top and dark denim jeans. It's just like a classic preppy bag, and I love monogram. I mean, I love everything about it. It's kind of the theme with this whole video. I love 
all of the things about everything in, in this video. Okay, moving on. Another fun summery St. Anne, this pink and white striped St. Anne tote to give you another look. So you'll notice that this is actually the Barrington crest that I got instead of my initials right here, just to switch things up. Um, and also my mom has a knack of stealing my bag, so she's always like, don't put your monogram on it so I can wear it. I use this all through summer. I took it to Seaside and use it as a beach bag. I think you can even see there's like sand. This is like a really fun summery one that I love obviously for warmer weather. This next St. Anne is the Darling Camo Print. I am in love with this bag for fall. Look how cute it would be with the shirt I have on. Didn't even plan that. See again, I just chose the Barrington Crest with this. This camo print looks so cute with the monogram stripes. They have like a brown and orange stripe, like the Hunter's Bright Orange. This has surprisingly been one of my most used bags in fall. I think in theory, if you told me, oh, camo, I've been like, no thanks. I'll leave that to the guys. But actually, this is a really cute and surprisingly very classic accessory to throw on. Oh, I am excited for these two next ones because these are new from the fall collection. First is one you may have seen already. It is this tan geometric pattern with the pink and tan stripe on a green. So you can see kind of closer up what that looks like. I actually designed this one because I wanted a fresher take on my very first tote, which was the first one you saw in this video, that brown and tan one. Since they don't have that style anymore, I wanted to kind of put those same colors in a new bag that I could just throw on with everything and anything and just take all over town. This has been that bag for me. I get so many compliments when I wear it and I seriously love this whole color combination. My final St. Anne bag that I'm going to show you is, I can't say favorites because truly each of them has a favorite aspect for whatever reason. I will say that this one is so incredible for fall. It's your classic black and brown check with this subtle brown and pink monogram. Do you see the pink lining around the monogram? This is my ride or die because it goes with everything. It looks so chic. And I love that as opposed to my stripe monograms on the other bags, I just think this is like more of a subtle, kind of like you have to look to find it. This is such a good everyday, goes with anything kind of print especially during fall months when I'm wearing so many of these shades, browns and blacks. Can't go wrong, love it so much. Whew, we have made it through the Saint and Tote collection and now I wanted to wrap up the video by showing you the two duffel bags I own. Anything on here would make a great Christmas gift, but if you have someone you really love, this might be the way to go. This is the cutest Belmont cabin bag. I got this obviously in that black and brown check print you just saw. And in true cape fashion, I got a pink and orange monogram right here. This is again one of those things that whenever I carry, I get comments on. It fits so much in here. It's a perfect size, perfect for traveling. Cannot recommend it enough. It comes with straps that are removable. I'll show you that in the next one. And here is the second cabin bag I own. This is in this really darling pink and orange. This was spring two years ago, I think. I'm not sure if it's still carried now. You can always email just to check. This to me is more of a fun, like overnight or spend the night bag. And here is a look at the straps that attach on the sides. Um, so you can carry it just like any normal duffel, but it's leather straps. Well, thank you for sticking with me through that whole collection video. I had such a fun time showing you all my favorite Barrington pieces. Well, I just can't recommend this brand enough. I'm just telling you like the quality of it, the offerings. These are amazing gifts, but also amazing splurge pieces for yourself. Really just don't have enough good things to say about it. So I'm curious to hear what was your favorite pattern? What was your favorite style? I've linked all of these below. You may notice that some of the links take you not to the exact bag, they take you to the bag builder. That's because some of these prints were carried in past seasons. My encouragement to you is just to go to the website, I'll link it below, and I just dare you to try to not spend more than five minutes on the bag builder creating different combinations and things. You could seriously spend forever doing it. I have done it before. I can attest that that is true. Tell me if you want more of these collections videos. I'm always hesitant to film collections videos because I never want to be like, look at all my stuff. That is not 
the purpose of this at all, and I never wanted to come across that way. So I'm just like interested to see how this one is received. Let me know what other types of videos you would like. And more than anything, I hope you have a wonderful, blessed day. I love you so much for coming and just taking the time to watch this, and I appreciate it a lot. I would love for you to follow along on Instagram, which is Lone Star Southern, if you'd like, and be sure to subscribe if you'd like to never miss a video. Okay, I'm officially cutting myself off from blabbing, and I'm gonna go eat some pumpkin bread. Hi y'all, talk to you later.